guys good morning guys oh guys how you all doing today is tuesday guys and uh, welcome to another vlog i want to go out right now to there's this meeting i usually go for on tuesdays where a lot of women come out to you know interact with one another is mostly for stay at home moms so guys i it's not really a compulsory place to go to but today i just feel like i should go because they've been calling me they're like ah oh, we haven't seen you for more than two weeks so i just felt like ah oh, why don't i just go and the amazing thing about being in this group is that anytime i go there there's a nursery where you can actually drop your your baby and then you have someone to take care of your baby for good two hours this group is a group where you can come out drop your baby at the you know nursery sit down with other women and you know interact with other women or you can actually just come and sit and uh, you know get, you can actually just come and you know find a place and rest or sleep if you want to so sometimes but that was earlier though when i had obina newly when i go there most times i'll just drop obina at the nursery for that two hours and i'll just go and sleep but recently i started interacting with other women i started learning about other cultures other cultures that are so similar to my culture you know so guys today i'll be going to that group and i'd like to carry you guys along i think i'll just generally show you guys what i'm going to be up to today so i hope you enjoyed this video and please give it a thumbs up like it share it and put on your bell notification to know when next i send the video don't forget to subscribe guys love you guys and have a nice day and please keep watching hey guys so i'm um, just where i'm supposed to be right now hi guys so guys i just finished from the meeting and i'm walking down to the post office to post my later it is so cold yeah you guys it is so cold but i just have to do this today because if i don't post this letter i don't know when i'm going to post it again Hobina is in his boogie and he's crying and you guys the reason why this boy is crying is just because i covered him like i don't want him to catch cold so i like to cover him when we're in the boogie when we are walking but this boy wants me to so he wants me to open the boogie so that he can be seeing me i'm sorry so guys this is what obina wants obina wants me to leave the boogie open so that he can be looking at my face while we're walking but like my fear is that i don't want him to catch cold but he doesn't care <laughs> He wants to be looking at his mommy's face. <laughs> it's okay, baby. You want to be seeing me. And you guys, honestly, sometimes I don't know if this boy is cold. I feel like this boy doesn't even care about this weather. I don't know if I'm the only one in this in this in now in my house that only feels cold. Obina doesn't care. Kaima doesn't even care at all. Look at him, he's still laughing. <laughs> You're laughing. You were laughing when I was talking. Eh? You were laughing when I was talking. You're not cold. Why? Look at look at that cute face. You're not cold. Eh? Me, I'm cold though. Honestly, I don't know how these these children do this. A quick update, guys. So I wanted to go straight from the meeting, the group I went for, the meeting I went for. I wanted to go straight to the post office from there. But I literally have to pass through my house to go there. It's about 10 minutes walk from here. And you guys, Obi was really, you know, crying and throwing tantrums. So I just felt like, oh, why don't I just come into the house and feed him, try to make him stop to stop crying, take care of him and 
then put him back for us to go back to the post office so i just felt there was a need for me to do that i came in here to do it and right now you guys he is sleeping right now he's sleeping he is sleeping right now so i'm going to put him back in the crib and in sorry sorry not the crib i'm going to put him back in his boogie and take him out to the post office because i really need to post that letter today i feel like if i don't post that letter today i might not really have time to i have all the time but man you guys this cold out there and if there's any time i hate in this country is this winter period I, uh, as in this winter i wish i don't have anything that will take me out i just like to stay indoors and just be at home and do my thing if i take him out to school i feel like that's the major thing i would love to be doing during the winter that's why i'm really going to the post office to post this my letter and make sure i get this provisional license so that i can have a car because i feel like if you have a car it's easier not to catch so much cold outside during the winter because like i don't know this cold is not friendly at all i don't want to always be out in the cold i don't like it at all so i really want to post this letter today so i'm going to put him back and go out there and you know post the letter um maybe when i'm coming back i'll then pick kaima because i feel like if i after posting the letter i'll just do some some random things around there uh, around there i don't know i don't want to come back to the house go out again in the cold to pick kaima i don't want to i'll just window shop if i can but if i if i if, if i have to come back because i feel like because there's really no need for me to waste a whole two hours outside when i'm not doing anything reasonable so i think i am i really am i come back let's see how it goes Sha. but i just wanted to give you guys a quick update see you guys so guys you guys i forgot to tell you guys that i was so sick over the weekend that i had a lot of blisters on my face on my lips especially you can see the blisters on my lips i was so sick this was the first time i had flu I never knew what they call flu but this was the first time and this flu is just like having malaria it's just like malaria because it will make you feel so weak you'll be shivering exactly all the symptoms of malaria was what i experienced over the weekend but thank god i am so fine today and the blisters are like clearing a bit i hope that maybe before the end of this week it will clear up so sorry that i look like a hot mess guys i'm sorry about that but it's all good i know you guys still love me anyhow i am the post office right now guys let me show you guys i had just finished you know posting what i came to post and honestly i think i still have some time guys because i still have like 40 minutes so i can always take 10 minutes to walk down to the house and then pick kaima i thought i wasn't going to i thought i was going to meet a lot of people but luckily i was just the first person that he was so free so i was the first person that he attended to so guys i am true and obi is being cranky but i want to buy a book for kaima like i want us to really get serious with study she's so smart like she can read her a to z she can you know uh, count her 1 to 20 but when it comes to scribbling you guys Kaima she cannot do anything when it comes to scribbling so I really want to take it very serious I want her to start learning how to write how to write so we started last week we started with uh, you know writing one scribbling and she was really doing so well but 
I don't uh, I have not really bought any book for her so today I want to just take this time now that I'm here and I've seen some books that I really think will do so I want to buy this exercise book for her it's very colorful it's very beautiful so i know she'll like it i want to buy it for her so that we can just get serious like i want it to be that before she starts the main school next year she'll be able to write her a to z if possible i know it might not really be possible but it, it's possible everything is possible so i want her to be able to and then i also want her to be able to write her one to at least 15 so i really want to get serious with her studies i want her to to start writing now but i'm not going to pressure her i'm not going to pressure her we'll just take it slowly but i really want her to get to the point that when she gets to the primary school next year it will be easier for her so i'm going to buy this book now So guys, I think I'm still going to buy some coloring books for her. She has one already. I'll still add some for her. I'll still buy one and add to what she already has. So you guys, I was trying to make Kaima's hair yesterday. But we couldn't finish. I guess we're going to finish it today. We just started. But I had to pack it and wear. Put on her cap for her. Where's your cap? It should be in your bag. It should be in your bag. Let's go. In your backpack. Say hi to guys. Hi guys. Yeah. I'm back home. I'm just trying to breastfeed Obin right now. I thought he was sleeping. I came back and he had, he was already sleeping when I brought him back. I thought he was going to sleep for me to kind of do something. But I thought I could just do like two things like make the bed because i didn't make the bed in the morning when we we're going out make the bed kind of like set arrange the house and the living room Obin woke up so i thought i was going to have this time for myself like just find something to eat because i'm really hungry and i want to eat samosa there's this samosa i used to buy so i want to fry it and eat I thought I was going to go and fix that for myself, but Obina woke up and then Kaima is eating her pancakes. Mommy, can yes, you make me this dress? What? Can you buy me this dress? So guys, sorry guys. So guys, I'm going to go downstairs now. I think he's going to sleep after this. I'll just go downstairs and fix what to eat. You guys like it's just three o'clock. It's just like about 3.30 now, but it's already dark outside. I'm going to show you guys. If I drop Obina now, I'm going to show you guys. It's already dark outside. So I'm using like the house lights. I thought I was going to get sunlight. That was why I came to this place. But it's so dark. So I'm going to do that. So honestly guys, like sometimes I feel I have a whole lot of work to do in this house. And then the more I work, the more it seems as if I have more work to do. Like I'm not doing much and I have laundry to do because over the weekend I was sick. I didn't do my laundry. I, I, didn't, I didn't do the laundry. So I'm going to do laundry. I'm going to steal. I think I'm going to do some things in Kaima's room. And then I think I'm going to make Kaima's hair. Wow. And Kaima's hair is really necessary because she needs to go to school with a good hair tomorrow. I don't want her to go to school and be looking odd. So that's that. I'll keep you guys posted. It's already winter. I don't know if this is winter or autumn. I can't really tell. But for me, I think it's winter. So guys, if you should look at what outside is like. It's so dark. And it's just 3.30. It's about 3.35 now. So, I'm going to go straight right to the kitchen and help myself. So guys, this is meat. 
this is spring rolls and samosa so i want to fry it now and eat Where's the other hand? Bring it out. Yeah. Tomatoes. Very important. Hello, friends. Wait, go and put it. Take more onions. Go and put the onions. No, we are not taking mushroom. We're going to take apple. Orange for Kaiba. Oh. So guys, as tired as I am, we decided to come and shop this evening because if we don't get to do it this evening, I don't know when we're going to have to do it this week. It might probably be on Saturday. And Saturday, we are not very sure because my husband's work schedule has really changed. We're not sure of when he's going to close. So we're here to come and shop this evening so that we can have enough things at home for this week and next week. So we are at Lidl right now. So I'm just going to do, we're just going to do just this Lidl shopping today. I think tomorrow I'll now do the African shopping myself.
Can we buy chicken? Let me put this. Yeah. You can put Kaima, you can put it. Can you? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Wow, you're a strong girl. But you put your hand here. Put your hand here, baby. See, put your hand here. Uh -huh, good girl. Oh gosh. This girl is a big girl. Oh. Wow, wow, wow. My angel is a big girl. Go and put in the. Go and put. Good girl. JT. Go and put. Go and put. Can you? <laughs> Kaima. This is girl. Kayama. What else do I need? Gosh, I cannot really figure out what I need. <laughs> well done, Kaima. Kaima has been so hard working today. <laughs> Look at where she runs to. So I'm going. I buy things that I give her. And she runs to give it back to her dad. What do you want? No, baby, you can't eat that. You take what you can eat. You take what you can eat, okay? No, no, you can't eat that. What's that? No, let's go and look for Pringles. Come. Come, let's look for Pringles. Guys, I have tried. I feel like I have picked the things I really need. I didn't make a list because I was kind of not sure if we were going to shop today. So I didn't really make a list, but I feel like I have picked what I really, really need. If I need any other thing, if I miss something else, I think I'll come back and get it. But I think I've picked the major things I really need to do. So guys, we'll be going home. No, we can't buy that, okay? Because you will not drink that. It's not for babies. Okay? You, you, you take children's juice, not that. Yeah, Red Bull is not for children. So we'll be heading home now, you guys. I'll speak to you later. It is so late now, guys. It's about 8 o'clock now, but we just had to do this.